Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. So I'm back. Yes. So today I'm gonna be doing a uh, reviewing some new vessels from Candle Science. Yes. So they were so kind to send me the beautiful candle things, guys. It's a beautiful. These are very uh, different, unique, you know. And I just wanna show them to you, okay? These are perfect. If you're thinking about uh, for Christmas, guys, order them now because these are gonna be perfect for Christmas, your Christmas lights, you know, and they're great for travel, you know, and they're just uh, one of a kind, okay? So let me just read you a little bit of information. Why use candle tins? Candle tins are favorite of our customers and staff. Unlike glassware, you can't see the wax through the container, so you don't have to worry about glass addition or frosted sides. As a bonus, candle tins always come up with a lid which takes the stress out of ordering process, okay? Durable and shatterproof, lots of candle makers use them as travel as travel tins since they are so sturdy. Samples, giveaways, and party favors are some of our favorite ways to use candle tins, especially the smaller sizes. They're easy to label and have raised safety features on the bottom to keep the burning surface cool. Additionally, a protective varnish Coating on the inside of the of the tins helps to protect the metal from discoloration. Okay, you can repurpose use candle tins as handy storage containers for desk accessories, knickknacks, and much more. With a variety of sizes in both classic and luxe styles, our growing collection of candle tins offer something for everyone. Yes. Okay. Yes. So in here, if you go to the website candlescience.com, you're gonna see all the different configurations, you know, they come, you know, you have beautiful colors, you know, so I'm gonna show you all the different configurations, but I'm not gonna show you all the colors because I only got a few of them, okay? Look at them, okay, perfect. So I'm gonna start with the with the bubble thing. I'm gonna show you the bubble thing, guys, especially the black one in here. Modern with a splash of lux, our black bubble thing with silver interior adds a glamorous touch to product lines. The, uh, the lid snaps shut for a secure fit. However, never lift a candle by the lid. Candles made with these unique tins will add elegance and to, to home decor or make the perfect gift. Also available in white, gold, silver, and bronze, okay? Add a feature, a raised safety ring that keeps the surface cool and candle burns happy. Okay, so let's show inside. Wow, look how beautiful it is, yes! Look at how it glows and look at how well made it is, guys. This is a beautiful, a beautiful tin. I love this. It's not shiny, shiny, you know, that is opaque like that. Okay, this I will make a label, perfect to label on the top or the bottom because it's, it's flat, so it's, it's gonna idea perfectly in here. Guys, so so you have options, you know. I would, I would think about not labeling this in here due to the angle in here. The, the circumference, I don't think the label will sit, sit flat, flush, so, but you have plenty of space in here and plenty of space at the bottom, okay? Perfect for the holiday, guys. Stock up now because, you know, the year's going up fast, okay? So then this one comes in black, in white, in beautiful gold. Wow, look at this. It looks very expensive, yes! It comes in silver. My favorite, I think my favorite is, is the silver one and the black one. I like them all. And look at here, the bronze. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. Okay, now let me tell you, okay. How much wax does it take? It takes a uh, wax weight to, to the field line is 6.7 ounces, okay. Uh, looking for a weak suggestions, they suggest if you use G, uh, GB-464 wax, they recommend a CD-22. If you use IGI-4630, they recommend LX-24. If you use IGI-6006, they recommend an Eco-10, okay? Now, they also say that check out their uh, the wig guide to see recommendations for other waxes. Our recommendations are estimates and, and should be used as a starting point to start your own burn testing, okay? So, because I use, on my candle line, I use uh, number seven, which is uh, formerly known as soy bliss wax. So I'm gonna start testing this, depending on the diameter of this. And I think the diameter of this is 
diameter in the top is 3.30 inches. The diameter in the middle is 6 point, uh, 3.625. Okay? Remember, this, the, the diameter in the center is wider, okay? Because that's why it has the curve in here, so you have to take, a, so you have to take that into consideration. No? So what I will do to wick this, I will do a double wick, wider, the diameter is wider than three inches, so I will, do, I will start testing my number seven wax with a double CDN number two, double CDN number, four, number three, or double CDN number four, okay? So what I recommend, this is what I do, is I do a wickless testing, which means I, I make the candle with no wicks, okay? So I let it cool down, I usually wait 24 hours until it's solidified, and then I take, and just make two holes, and then you uh, put the, the wick in there, okay? So you start testing it. So, so start using with a double CDN number two, and see how that works, you know, how, see how the, uh, the, uh, the metal pool develops, and then you go from there, okay? And then when I, once I know that that wick uh, configuration works, then you can just melt the wax, remelt the wax, and then just uh, place the wicks in there that, you want, that you're gonna be using, and then just test it again, okay? So that's my recommendation. I don't like to do, I don't like to, I don't like to waste time by just making a, you no, know, just a, a full candle. I'd rather test first, and then go from there. The next vessel, okay, so let me show, so I'll show you the colors. So the next vessel they sent me was, uh, the, the, the large infinity tin in bronze is this one here. Look how beautiful it is. I love the, the safety feature they have at the bottom, you know. Perfect, you know. And again, this has a varnish coating to help, help uh, prevent the uh, discoloration. But they also tell you that it all depends on which fragrance oil you're using. If you have citrus, if you have vanillin, uh, um, they have the tendency to discolor the inside of the... Um, of, of the vessel, but you know, so it's, you cannot help it, you know, it all depends on the fragrance oil, okay? So this one, it says the infinity tin with a silver interior is a straight-sided seamless candle tin complete with a flush lid. The lid snap closed for a secure seal. However, never lift a candle container by the lid. That's absolutely true. These sophisticated containers fit a variety of branding styles. They're also available in white, gold, silver, and well, this uh, and black. For a complete product line, pair these tins with a matching mini black infinity tin. I mean, mini bronze infinity tin. So, like, you pair it with this one, okay? They are so cute together, guys. <laughs> Aren't they? Look at this. It's like the mini me, you know? So, for some people, what I will do is I make the same candle, one in the big size and the other one in the small size. So, you know, depending on the price point that people can afford, they have the option to buy the regular size or the mini size, okay? So you cannot go wrong with these, guys, okay? So always pair them together, okay? Perfect for Christmas. Okay, so the big infinity tin wax weight is 11.5 ounces, okay? Uh, if you, for weak suggestions, they suggest to start your testing at GB, if you use GB464 wax, use a CD. 22, uh, if you use IGI 4630, use LX24, and if you use IGI 6006, you start you testing at Eco 10, okay? Perfect, let me see if it has anything, any other information that I may be interested in, let's see. Okay, now for the mini team, well, let me just show you. Let me just show you the lid. It's so well made, guys, look at this in here, it snaps. Snaps shot, okay? Beautiful. Very bougie. The, the mini one, it also shots very tight, okay? Look how beautiful it is. Look at, again, the raised legs for security, added security. So when you put it in the, in the in, on the burning surface, it's not gonna get uh, hot. Okay, so let me tell you about this, okay? The mini infinity tin with silver interior is a straight-sided, seamless candle tin complete with a flush lid that snaps closed. These petite containers fit a variety of branding styles and are also available in white, gold, silver, and black, okay? Okay, the candle science tins are, also, are, are safe and easy to use thanks to the raised safety fit that keeps the surface cool and candle burns happy, okay? Great, okay. 
So the uh, the wax weight for this is 3.4 ounces. And if they, uh, for weak suggestions, start use testing. If you use GB464, start with CD8. For IGI 4630, start with uh, LX14. And for IGI 6006, start testing with Eco2. Okay, beautiful. Yes, guys, I think it's gonna be great. For anyone, you know, who's looking for something new, something different, something for travel, something light, uh, something that is not clean, something that you don't see the imperfections from the wax. You know, sometimes when you use uh, 464 wax, some, or some, some other kind of um, soy wax, sometimes you get the frosting. This one, you, you don't have to worry about it because you don't see it, the wax, okay? So I highly recommend it for anyone who's starting the kind of journey to think about starting with kind of things, you know, it's a, it's a great way for you to get it introduced to the beautiful art and kind of making guys. And I don't think you can go wrong with any of these. So again, this is from kind of size. So you go to the website, you know, and just check them out. Okay. So, okay guys, so I'm going to leave the video here. Uh, I just want to thank you for uh, joining me today, guys. And I'm going to try to keep the videos coming uh, until the next video, guys. I'll see you in the next one. Yes. Yes.